give you a proper send off. Not getting shot today. Here's where it gets interesting. Hunter. Case closed. Our man died as sloppily as he killed your friend. Oh, too soon? Sorry. Nah, it's all right. I suppose if we can't put the killer behind bars, we can at least put him in a bucket. Or five. What the chanting? All the symbols. Yeah, I'll leave that for your podcast to work out. Good work, Vault Hunter. See you out on the streets. Justice brings a glimmer of light to Eschaton Row. But where the light shines, the shadows only grow deeper. What's hiding in those shadows? All we know is, it just keeps getting mysteriouslier. See you next episode, listeners. I really hope that wasn't what we paid so much money for the fucking series we passed for. Because I'm going to be pissed. paid 30 bucks for something that was less than 40 minutes worth of content. I'm getting kind of pissed, you know. My arms race is completely retarded. Because <clears throat> all you can bring out of there is three items. That's it. Soft versus your junk. Nothing but shitty, shitty weapons throughout. This is the only customizable thing I got, and it's a repeat. So let's go up and see if she has any more missions for me.
A bushel of monkey gets. Saying for the um, arms race on this, it's a complete waste of time. You can only get out, I do believe, three items. That's it. And they're always underpowered compared to what you already had. You can go in as Mayhem 10 and then it becomes 10 times harder. You know? Obviously, because it's Mayhem 10, blah, 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 blah. But also the fact that you start with absolutely nothing. You had to find your shields and your grenade mods and this and that and all this nice little stuff and then you have to hopefully win to get all your stuff out it's just bananas See you again, Vault Hunter. Circumstances aside. Today we're talking to Clay. He's a smuggler, quick with a pistol. We don't know what's under those goggles, but the supernatural reporter suspects it's a mischievous glint. When she's right, she's right. Here's the rub. Friend of mine, hisn't, he's disappeared. He left me this message. Catch anything in there that makes sense to you? Hmm. You mentioned a pack. 
That's a loaded word around these parts. It comes with all sorts of implications. Supernatural implications? For some. I only trust Or he's my just getting married and he can't speak anymore. But if Hizen says he's in trouble, we gotta find him and free him from this pack. Natural or otherwise. The Grove won't make a path for us on his own time. We have to cut our way through. This supernatural reporter's cursory Econet search sheds some light on the shaded secrets lying beneath the canopy of Eden Six. Whispers of witch covens, of ancient rituals and curses passed down generations. If his and waded into these dark waters, he may have found them deeper than he could have imagined. Maybe it's just my imagination, but it seems like the jumping might be better on this map. Ugh. <sighs> 